Hello, hello, hello! You guys have been asking about the theme I use on my laptop, so I just thought a quick video would answer your guys' questions. Go ahead and open up your internet browser. And we will be typing in. Dun 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 dun! Placebo theme! Yes, people, that easy. The first link, it is a Deviant Art link by the user SoulMiler. I think that's how you pronounce it. And you have two, four, six, eight themes in this package. Eight of them. Yes. Eight. This one is the one I use. It is called Angus. Angus Ang Street Angquist. I don't know. I think that's the one I use. Yes, that is the one I use. This one. The one with the orange background. This one. Yes. So just go ahead and download that one. Next, the icons. You will want to go back to Google, my friends. Type in token icons. Oh, I spelled that wrong. Spelled it wrong again. Here we go. Oh my god. Okay, it's the first link. Username. I don't know how to say that. I'm sorry. B-R-E-S-E-V. We have two sets with this. You have the light set and you have the dark set. I, of course, am using the light set because it looks beautiful. Go ahead and download that as well. Now to install these guys. Well, I have already made a video on how to install custom themes, so I will link that up on the screen right now. Flash, flash, clickety, click, click. The icons, I have found a better way to install icons, so download the link below and it is a program called 7 conifer yes 7 conifer you can place that file anywhere I just placed it in my program files because I just did it so the icon set that you just downloaded I believe there's two folders you want to open up 7 conifer then open up your icon package now the icons token the token icons you just downloaded drag those folders into your package folder just drag them they should be right here see just like so you can choose whichever one you want there should be some already some um icons in here as well they're really i don't like them well this one's kind of nice but i like the token set the most Anyways, now the application file right here, right click that, click as run as administrator, yes. Now you can see the tokens icons are down by the bottom on the left side. So go ahead select whichever one you want to use, hit apply, and it doesn't matter what you check, just make sure taskbar is checked. And then you hit apply. And your icons down here will be changed. It's like voodoo magic, people. Now for the start menu. The start menu, that's another program as well. I don't know why I just exit that out. But go ahead, download the other link again. And again, you can place that anywhere you want. It is called a Windows 7 Start Orb Changer. Again, run this as administrator. Yep, yep, yep. And you will want to change. Now, I don't know where I put the... Oh, here it is. Yes, right here. Windows Flag. I'll upload that for you guys because I don't know where I found that online. So I'll just upload that. Go ahead and you select open. And then I'll do all this funky stuff. And then it should change. And then a screen should pop up. Yep, start orb has been changed successfully. You click OK. And voila! It's like voodoo magic again, times two. So that's about it. If you have any questions, go ahead and just leave them down below. I will answer them. PM me. Do whatever you want to get a hold of me. I have a Twitter that... I just created so you could ask me on there I don't care 
it's X Gamer Girl X. So that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed watching, and thanks for watching. <laughs>